Welcome back everybody, Dylan here, Space Cadet Crypto. For those that are new to the channel and you are looking at different altcoins, Bitcoin, following the cryptocurrency markets, I would suggest you hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, turn on post notifications and alerts so you won't miss any of these crucial updates here because I'm covering Bitcoin to the T here. We have this fractal here that you can see in green and Bitcoin is following it perfectly. But let's get back to the main uh topic of this video which is crypto.com so we have a lot of fundamental news um that just came out recently for crypto.com and we do have something in the charts that shows a nice increase in the volume and uh momentum of crypto.com in the next coming days to weeks uh, but if you're interested in all that and keeping up to date remember hit the like button hit the subscribe button turn on post notifications but let's get right in and let's just jump into this fractal that we've been following for the last couple days now um i think i've been following it for five days when i last re uh, released my video on btc heading to 70k by the end of may it's very feasible and as you can see my fractal that i picked up um, if you want to uh, know more in depth about my price targets and everything for this fractal uh, i would suggest you watch the video my previous video that i released a couple days ago it goes over everything in detail but for the most part just a quick update it is um, this fractal right here that we saw here in the beginning of at the end of february right when uh futures expirations expired and move this move all the way up here to the top to around sixty thousand dollars so that's this fractal right here uh, but let's zoom in here a little bit more and we can see that we can see that the price has followed it perfectly so we had a huge um a huge move to the upside correction a huge impulse to the upside correction another move to the upside correction and now look we're following the same higher low trend here towards the upside and we have seen a nice bounce here moving back up and retesting this horizontal resistance right here that we see so i do see maybe a slight pull back here and then a huge move to the upside yet again breaking back into this right here this ascending wedge so this rising wedge so that's what i see in the charts for bitcoin uh, just a quick update on the markets right now um we did see yesterday when i was covering uh my bitcoin miners i said it was over here um at around 55,000, I said there's going to be a huge move coming here towards this resistance again. And look at that. To a T, it happened. We went up to almost 59,000 today in the morning. So that was very exciting to see. And a lot of altcoins are pumping. But let's get into crypto.com, the CRO token. Let's look at some fundamental news here. Let's take a look at this first article. It says crypto.com unveils EVM blockchain functionality and related fund. So it says in the coming months, so very soon in July, uh, crypto.com's blockchain will let projects build on uh built on ethereum transfer over to its own ecosystem via ethereum virtual machine the evm compatibility the company also unveiled a related fund to bolster interested projects according to a friday public statement from the company provided in coin telegraph the evm feature goes live on the crypto.com org blockchain on july 14th of this year evm support will be implemented as a side chain the statement noted um, this is very exciting news. It is just opening up their ecosystem, getting a lot more people using their ecosystem and using their own blockchain. And they're um, partnering with projects built on Ethereum. So that's a great thing. As you know, Ethereum is making huge moves right now. Um, we should see a, a slight pullback from Ethereum, but that's for another video. But as this here, by bringing EVM to crypto.com, um, the crypto.org chain, the company hopes to give its blockchain greater versatility with larger crypto ecosystem. The EVM support will allow for simple porting of apps from other chains driving exponential ecosystem growth huge that's what we need we need that volume and for crypto.com or crypto.org a fully decentralized open source public chain with high speed and extremely low fees that's super super enticing especially for new people that are investing into crypto.com or or just any exchange or the cryptocurrency in general we're looking for low fees ethereum has very high gas fees as of the moment they are working on that but look crypto.com here is already focusing on low fees a very important thing uh, crypto.com ceo and founder chris marzalek said in the public statement um, and it says here, in addition to public, uh, publicizing the upcoming EVM functionality, a new source of funding for industry startups was also unveiled. The statement detailed called the CRO EVM Fund, and it will be aimed at early stages projects developing on the blockchain. So now they're also putting a fund 
for new developments on the blockchain as well. So that's a very good thing to see. They're trying to expand. Crypto.com knows its worth and it's trying to expand its own blockchain and versatility with Ethereum and other base projects on that system. The fund looks to also give 100 projects significant capital to help with their endeavors. That's a lot. So they're putting their money where their mouth is. They're investing in these projects and they want their ecosystem to grow and accelerate. And it's headed up by Particle B, a startup accelerator. Wow, so look, they know that time is ticking. So this is very great news to see here for crypto.com. That's why we saw a nice move to the upside um, this past couple of days, around 10% move. Uh, but let's also look at some other news here. We see that crypto.com also becomes the official sponsor of Italy's soccer club final, uh, soccer cup final. The uh, crypto exchange is sponsoring the Coppa Italia final between uh, Atalanta and Juventus on May 19th. So that's next week. So a little bit over a week from now, we're going to be seeing crypto.com. Uh, sponsorship stuff all over this final cup here. It says Hong Kong based cryptocurrency exchange crypto.com will sponsor the final of Italy's soccer cup final competition, the Coppa Italia, taking place May 19th. Um, it says to commemorate the event, a collection of non fungible tokens, NFTs, which crypto.com has. Um, uh, put out recently some new nfts will be made available featuring the trophy match highlights and more uh, the two organizations intend to create a new experience for football fans in italy and beyond and crypto.com's partnership with italian football follows from its deal with the aston martin uh cognizant formula one team also marked by a collection of nfts to commemorate the brand's return to f1 after a 60 year absence and it says the exchange signed a sponsorship deal with the montreal canadians professional hockey team hockey team in March as well. So they are just expanding their brand here, crypto.com. So this is very good fundamental news, putting the name of crypto.com out there. But now let's get back into the charts for crypto.com and see what the next moves are. So we are looking at this pattern right here. In my last couple of videos, I was talking about a double bottom forming and it looks like it's coming to fruition here because we have set a higher low and we are continually setting a new higher low. This is a great bullish um, indicator here. And we're also seeing here, this is a two hourly chart. Let's look on the four hourly real quick. We are seeing an inverse head and shoulders also popping up here too as well. Now, it, it's not really a a great inverse head and shoulders because we are coming from a place of um of price action going to the upside but we do see a shoulder here a head here and another shoulder here that being said it is still loosely um, not yet confirmed but we are seeing significant resistance here at my resistance box which i drew uh we're seeing resistance here here and we're starting to see resistance here as well these past couple of days where we tried to get back up into this level as support we do see some huge wicks to the upside um, but nothing yet confirmed if we're having a breakout or not. But we are seeing some nice buying volume here. And our RSI is coming towards this overbought territory. So be on the lookout for that um, for a test towards this top of the resistance coming back down here. If we see that, we might see some more continual price action in this range of trading. But as of right now, we are still in this bullish momentum. We have found support here at the 18 cent mark to move up. And we've been trading in this channel now. For the last couple weeks, uh, let's see here, since the end of April. So for the last week, we've been trading in this range. And now we are ready to retest this area here and use this area as support for our next couple of days of price action. Very good to see. We're also talking about how this how the symmetrical trying here breakout broke to the downside right here, met our target at this support box. We moved back up and now we're facing this resistance back up here again, which we face other days before but let's look at the uh price target for this head and shoulders pattern here if this does manage to play out uh let's take it from the head here to the bottom um, move it up here and we do see our price target right back here at this ascending support line so that would be great to see here uh, of course we'd have some uh, resistance here coming back into this pattern but it would be the price target of 21 cents around that area of 21 cents Let's also take a look at the EMA ribbon as well. So we are actually starting to use this EMA ribbon here as support like we saw here in the previous areas right here when we're forming the symmetrical triangle. We have flipped bearish here at the moment. We have come down and now it looks like we're flipping bullish again to use this EMA ribbon as support in the next coming days to push us through this resistance box. That's been such big resistance for the last couple of weeks. 19 cents 
to 20 uh 19 cents to uh 19 six cents here between this 19 cent range has been huge resistance so far but the ema ribbon is showing some support if we also take a look at our um, just regular moving averages we are finding support here on the 21 the 50 and we are finding resistance here at the 200 ema ribbon um i'm sorry the 200 uh moving average this red line right here we're finding a lot of resistance and it's very confluent from this price action here our descending uh, resistance and apart with our 200 moving average acting as resistance we've only found wicks here to the upside nothing yet concreting us moving towards the upside for a breakout just yet um, but let's look at our lower time frames as well let me just zoom out here let's look at the one hourly and we did find um just wicks here we haven't closed anything significant just yet we closed one body candle here um at around 10 a.m but we have since found a huge wick to the downside and are holding this area but we are breaking back down here our next area of support would be at this 19 cent range 18.95 cents range if we do uh, make our way back down let's find where we could find some support let's use a fib retrace level uh, from the swing low to swing high, we are finding support right now at the 0.382 level. That's a very good sign. Um, usually we have a nice, huge impulsive move to the upside, then a small retracement to this 0.382 level, and then we can make another move to the upside. Next price target um, would be if we were to break this retracement level, be the 0.5, which would be at 18 uh, 77 cents. And then we also have our golden pocket here at 61 to 60. Uh, or six or 0.618 to 0.65 retrace level the golden pocket at 0 0.8 0.1857 for crypto.com so very exciting right now we do have this nice move we are continually um knocking on this door of resistance here and remember the more times we are hitting and touching this resistance the more likely it is to break out to the upside so this is looking very bullish so far nothing just yet to confirm a uh, rejection but we do want to keep in this range of trading here and we have been doing that so far we had a tiny m pattern right here but we have since invalidated it and moved back to the upside to retest this resistance box so many times such huge resistance here since um since the end of april but we are seeing some nice moves to the upside let's look at some other stuff real quick let's look at the daily um, just to zoom out and just look at the bigger picture sometimes because we forget um, sometimes how important it is to look at the bigger picture. And this is exactly what I'm talking about. We have this huge W pattern here that we've been looking at a couple of days. The price target for that also would be confluent with uh, break into the upside right here too, right? Exactly breaking up here and, and finding resistance here at the 22 cent mark. So a lot of interesting stuff and exciting things to come for crypto.com. We have big fundamental news of their own ethereum vehicle blockchain and then they also have their sponsorships that they're having uh sponsoring sports teams and sports games and that's a very huge especially because they're also in nfts and nfts are huge with the sports community there's a lot of stuff there for um for collectibles and they're noticing the market is growing in that area so they are investing in that area it's a great thing to see here for crypto.com and its price action within the next couple of days here but we will be updating you on this channel remember to hit that like button hit the subscribe button if you found something informative on this video don't forget to turn on post notifications to keep updated all the time with my latest videos but that is it for this video thank you for staying to the very end peace out